All right, thank you for joining us for this Wednesday Art Life Live. Today's theme, imagine. And I'm gonna introduce you to my Art Life winner. Let's get this, sto this, this show started, let's go. All right, thank you guys so much for joining us. Uh, we are live right now. Uh, we're gonna kick things off first by doing a roll call. Where are you tuning in from? We are live right now on Facebook, YouTube, Twitch, and over here we have TikTok and Instagram as well. So uh, I'm gonna shout out the first person who commented here on Facebook, Rob Kid. hello to you. Uh, Gordy is back on YouTube, hello to you. And uh, again, as you're tuning in right now, let me know where are you tuning in from? We're gonna start this session in about a minute and a half. So uh, where are people tuning in from on, we got Mexico, South Wales, Anaheim, Chile, Idaho, Australia, Ecuador, Melbourne, Fontana, California, Sacramento, I see Jimmy Brown in Georgia, Miami, welcome, welcome. All right, so as you guys are tuning in too, I cannot wait to introduce you to my painting giveaway winner. And you know why it's special? Because I texted about three different people and the third one finally got back to me. So I, I wanna start off by saying, if you get a text from me, I hope you get back. Cause I just, you know, I'm here to, to give away paintings. So um, also I see uh, Brandy and Callie, uh, Eric and Natomas, Reese in uh, Albany, Georgia, John in Florida, Gordy's in New Zealand. Tune all the way from New Zealand. Welcome, Gordy. Uh, what you said, West Virginia? Yeah, he was on TikTok too. All right. Gordy was on TikTok. And then Scott uh, in Missouri, I see you. Uh, Denver, I think that's Michaela in Denver. Welcome. All right, so how do you win these paintings? It's super easy. Uh, all you do is text the word Art Life to five. 8885 it enters you to win unfortunately it only works on us numbers uh but fortunately if you have a us number you gotta enter to win so before we get started with this first painting uh i'm gonna introduce you guys to kedby who is my winner and uh super excited for her so we're gonna do that and again if you are on tiktok and instagram you want a better audio and visual experience uh, go to my facebook.com forward slash Gary the Arts or my YouTube channel. I'm here live right now. So uh, let's get things started and let's meet my uh, Art Life winner, painting giveaway, meet Ted B. All right, everybody, I'm here with my Art Life uh, winner here in May, my winner, Ted B. Everyone say hello. Hi. Yes, yes. So I texted you earlier today, and I don't think you believe that it was real, right? No, I didn't. I absolutely didn't. Yeah. <laughs> I did not believe it. <laughs> well, this is absolutely real, and uh, I can't wait to send you your painting. Uh, again, I just want to thank you and your family. I think it was your, yes. your kids that follow me as well, right? Yes, absolutely. It was one of them. I had no clue, and <laughs> that's why I was so in shock. I was like, what's going on? Oh, that's awesome. Well, Kedby, great to meet you. Uh, you told me earlier you're a baker, you're baking right now, and yes. you're in uh, the New Jersey area, is that correct? Yes, I am in New Jersey. All right, and I'm gonna tag you so that you guys can follow her. I, I checked out her cakes, they look amazing, and I hope that, I'm hope i sure they taste delicious as well. So, all right, we're gonna let you get back to, uh, to baking, but Kedby, congratulations, you are Thank my you winner. Thank so, you so much. Thank you very, very much, and I cannot wait to get my baking. Yes, awesome. All right, bye. All right, bye. All right, congrats to Ked B, but let's get started on this first painting today. I'm gonna get a little bold right now. I'm gonna, I usually end with this. I'm gonna start with this. Again, today's 
theme, imagine. Let me know as always, let me know your questions below in the comments. All right, that's a good bold start right there. All right, so they asked, how has life been in quarantine? It's been very interesting to say the least. I would start off, let me actually get some paint real quick. I would start off by saying life in quarantine is completely different than the past. Just 10 years of my life, I've been traveling nonstop. And so for me, I've actually been enjoying it. I've been loving being home. Uh, you know, getting home cooked meals from my girlfriend Chadi all the time. Uh, what else? Just, you know, spending time with my kids, my dogs, probably eating too well. <laughs> but, um, you know, it's also been challenging too. I think that with everyone, none of us are used to staying home this much unless you're, you know, a professional introvert, which I'm sure there's some of you out there like that. But um, it's been great for the most part. I just cannot wait though to have things just open up. I know there's a lot of you that are affected by this, you know, maybe your work, maybe stuck away from family. I just wanna see all of you just get back to normal life as you would want it. Yeah, so uh, Lena in Australia just asked, she just started doing live painting and uh, how can you, any tips basically, and what was the other part of it? How do you any keep, tips to reach a wider audience. any tips to reach a wider audience? This is the number one tool right now to reach a wider audience is give your audience more of you, tell your story. Um, and I would say, you know, the other part is yeah, I, th I think just like we have all these tools in front of us, you know, you're talking to me on the phone right now in Australia. I think take advantage of the time and attention that you have with people right now and um, start there. But also, you know, shoot a lot of content, shoot as much as you can and, um, and put it out as often as you can for right now. And that way you'll also learn through the process. But great question. <laughs> I love how you start reading them. You're like, ah, well, let's not answer that question. Um, we'll do shout outs later on. Let's do questions as I paint. So by the way, uh, normally, I'm gonna talk about this process, normally, when I start these paintings, I start with brushes and an undertone. And today I was like, let's get the big paint roller. Yes, this is, a, this is an easy one. You guys will see this one come to life very, very quick. No Harry Potters yet? Come on, guys. Have I ever painted any super realism portraits? Not really, it's not really my thing. Um, there's a lot of artists that spend their whole life getting really good at that, and I just leave that up to them to do. For me, I love the expressionism. I love um, bringing to life portraits of people and hoping that it feels like them as much as it does look like them. Harry Potter, yeah, there we go. How do you guys for, 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 for doing that? Let's get some new brushes. So someone asked, what inspired me to be an artist? I know, I think, you know, the one thing that inspired me was just following my heart. I don't think I ever thought of doing anything else besides creating. 
it, the hardest part was narrowing it down the type of creating that I wanted to do. So. Someone asked, uh, do I ever give my shoes away? I do actually, I have given them away. We just, maybe I should do that for the next giveaway. Yes, yeah, so a great question. Someone asked, where can they get my artwork and even a custom one? If you visit garibaldiarts.com forward slash gallery, all the info you need is there. There's actually a link in my bio where you can get that info about original paintings and custom paintings. Yes, so look for Garibaldi Arts on all social media platforms right now. We're live on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitch, and then on our phones and devices on TikTok and Instagram. I have. So someone said, have you ever had someone that I painted some my portrait? Uh, yeah, I mean, everyone from uh, Diddy to, uh, you know, Kiss. So last year when I was on tour with Kiss, the, the third painting that I did on stage was of the band. And every night they signed it and we would auction it off for charity. We raised, you know, over $600,000 for charity last year on that tour. So you can just scroll through my page. Someone asked, uh, where do you see a Kobe painting? Just scroll through my page and you'll see a tribute I did to Kobe and Gigi. I, I, th I mean, I think so. I think someone asked, is this the most famous beetle? What do you guys think? I mean, Paul McCartney's still alive, but when we talk about famous and influential, I think that John Lennon was the most influential uh, Beatle. But let me ask you guys this, on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, was John Lennon the most popular Beatle or the most influential? Let me know below in the comments. Is that a choice for me? Oh, okay. I was like, oh, I'm going to go with Keanu Reeves on that one. Who was what? Ooh, my first portrait ever was Jimi Hendrix. It was like the standard portrait, I feel like, when you start this style of painting. Uh, Denny Dent had popularized it. So I was like, and also the J Jimi Hendrix um, face and the shape of it was just so iconic. Someone asked, have I painted my girlfriend yet? Uh, <laughs> I, don't, I don't think so. I, I'm, I'm too nervous to do that. So, so nervous to paint you. I, I'm just studying her every day so that I can eventually figure it out. So a lot of times, a lot of things you guys can't see up close, you really only see in the final painting is how much I blend as I go. So, um, you know, there's a lot of different colors on here, a lot of different layers, and, you know, also up close, which we're gonna set this up so we guys can show you guys some more up close stuff, but um, there's a lot of blending as I'm painting in this process. Someone asks, where am I from? from Sacramento, California. I was born in Los Angeles, but I grew up here in Sacramento. It's always been home to me. All right, let's ditch these. I wanna add some, some. So someone asked, who is my favorite artist? I, I feel like it changes every day but 
think, um, you know, Andy Warhol is, is, you know, one of my favorites just because of where he took art. Um, Ernie Barnes is an incredible artist that um, popularized the neo-mannerism style of painting. Who else? Man, there's uh, Leroy Neiman is one of my favorites. I love Leroy Neiman. I know there wasn't a lot of guessing with this portrait today, especially with the theme being imagined, but I just, you know, sometimes these are exercises for me to uh, make sure that I still know portraits that I've done in the past that I've memorized. So this is just a fun process also for me. Uh, I do. So someone asked if I had visited the school in Chicago. You were there also. Yeah, yes. I do remember that. On TikTok? <laughs> okay, interesting, interesting. So this is what I love too, is uh, you know a lot of you are guessing, come over here, a lot of you are guessing who this is sometimes and the answer is always right because the answer is based on your life experience, what you've been exposed to, your lack of or the vastness of it and so everything you throw out is you know you see the glasses and, and uh, the hair and the jawline and so you may relate it to something that you already know which is technically right so really this portrait can be whoever you wanted to based on your knowledge and that's the beauty of it now i'm trying to make it to be john lennon but uh the fun part is that you get to guess and make it whoever you want it to be So Creator X uh, is going great. It's just been a challenge this year because we can't have the physical camp, but we just um, started working on doing a virtual version of the camp, which we'll be announcing very soon on this live stream. Okay, okay. Paint. Yeah, you guys gotta let me know below in the comments. Uh, what are portraits that you haven't seen me do, do before? What would you wanna see in the future? So just adding, this is my favorite part. I feel like this is what gives it life. It's just these little, little dots. How, how the, eye, the, the light just reflects off of the eye. done wrestlers someone asked on was it TikTok? okay oh yes yeah i mean rest in peace to shad from wwe i've done a wide range of of most subjects i mean everything from nascar drivers to wrestlers um you name it maybe not specific people yet but um a lot of different categories so jimmy brown on facebook is suggesting blues brothers all right let's uh Let's keep this one going. We're gonna start adding some hair to this.
Just gonna let that drip. I love those drips. That's like when the paint drips, it's like the paint taking on its own life at that point and I have no control over it. And we'll give you guys a closer look at this as I wrap it up in just a little bit. Let's get some spray paint over here. Let's uh, let's highlight some some features on Mr. Lennon. I would like to flip in his hair. This little mist sort of uh, mist over the shadows to soften the face just a little bit. The, the black canvas can be a little harsh. I'm gonna mist it just a little bit. Again, these are things that you'll be able to see either in person or up close in just a little bit. But let's throw some paint and then we'll wrap this one up. You'll hear me guys talking out loud to myself. I'm gonna go back with this skin tone, highlight some areas on the face. Again, this also gives it more depth because I'm going over some of those undertones of the colors and it just gives it some texture too. So someone asked, I think just, so someone asked, am I doing anything special for Memorial Day? Um, I am gonna do a sale, a Memorial Day sale in my online store. So stay tuned for that and uh, I'll let you know how you can get the code for the discount on the store for the weekend. But as for plans, I'm gonna hang out with my family. All right, let's wrap this up. All right, let's wrap this one up. Take one last look. Whew. All right, take one last look at this John Lennon painting and I'm gonna clean up and I'll be right back. So yeah, show them up close, show them like all, how all the color mixes. If you guys can hear me on TikTok and Instagram and even Facebook right now, we'll show you in a second on Facebook, but um, you know, this is to me, you know, it's not just about the experience of painting, but also the painting has to stand alone on its own at the end. All right, thank you guys again for joining me for this Art Life Live session. Uh, earlier, if you're just joining us, we did a FaceTime with my winner, Ked B. She was my winner for the uh, painting giveaway. And uh, she's based in New Jersey. She's a baker, she's working hard right now. We, she took some time to uh, FaceTime with me. And again, if you want to um, enter to win uh, one of my paintings, let me see if this will pop up. It will not. Okay, if you want to enter to win one of my paintings, we'll do another giveaway in the next two to three weeks. Text the word Art Life to 58885. That'll enter you to win if you've done it already. No need to do it again. Also, um, I'll be sending out uh, some secret texts to my 
uh, my text list, you guys will be getting uh, some codes for discounts for my online store. And also you'll, be, you'll find out about a new product we have coming out this week. You're gonna find out on Thursday before the rest of the world. So I always wanna make sure I share that exclusive news with my text list. Again, art life to five. 8885. Um, so Gordy said you should do an international giveaway. I agree. And you know what, Gordy? Maybe we should do an email list rather than a text list. So I will share about that sometime soon. But either way, I appreciate you guys joining us. Um, any last shout outs? You guys want any shout outs before I sign off today? Where? Yeah, so if it, the message doesn't go through, you're texting the wrong number. Again, all the info is on, it's on my site. It's actually all over my social media. But if you text Art Life to 58885, it'll enter you to win. Um, and where are you guys tuning in from? Before I, I sign off, where in the world are you? So I want to shout out your city. So, so Shannon Hamilton said, uh, should have, you should have custom face masks for sale. Interesting you said that. Ooh, interesting. Um, you have to wait and see. Actually, you'll find, maybe you'll find out if you uh, get my texts from my text list. So, all right, guys, we're going to sign off. Thank you all so, so much for joining us for this Art Life Live on Wednesday. We'll be back on Friday with uh, some more art, some more inspiration, and um, we're just going to, you know, kick things off before we all go on. Most of us go on a Memorial Day weekend. So once again, my name is David Garibaldi and this is Art Life Live.